Thursday. I was just going through um, the vlogs and just been since I've been doing the vlogs I noticed how much weight I've gained I've gained a ton of weight like I can see it in my face I don't know if you guys probably noticed it. if you see my earlier vlogs since I was before pregnant I don't you know I had gained a ton of weight even before I had Emmanuel and before Nehemiah that's when I started to really pick up the weight but I just noticed I gained so much weight and it makes me feel awful like gosh I look a hot mess <laughs> It's really bad. I don't know how much I weigh now. I haven't even weighed myself in forever. And I know I've gained a ton of weight. I'm heavier now than I was like nine months pregnant. So I've gained my pregnancy weight and some more weight. And so I've just been really feeling down about that. It's just like disgusted in myself how much weight I've gained. Um, and I was just looking on YouTube today and I came across um, Miss v, v Holmes vlog how she lost so much weight and she looks the bomb she looks good and she's doing so good and I was looking at your vlog and it really motivated me in a way and it made it seem like it was more realistic something I can do um, and I'll link her video I don't know I think she did it a little while back but she lost like 20 pounds in a month and she's been doing really good and she talked about the main thing was a lifestyle change not just going on like a fad diet but like realistic things I can do like the smoothies and drinking the teas and drinking more water my biggest issue is fast food what my job I work in hospice so I'm always on the road always going in and out of people homes so I'm always quick to like go to a fast food restaurant um, and like grab a burger on the way to my next patient's house so literally my office is my car um, and so I'm in a car all day so it's really really easy for me to get junk food to eat on so I'm thinking of ways of like cutting back on the fast food and finding things I can eat literally that's my issue eat in the car things I can I gotta pack my lunches so I'm really I'm um, thinking about thinking of plan what I can do to lose weight to eat better to take better care of myself because I obviously see that I've gained a ton of weight and it's not healthy for me it's not good and it's really getting out of control it has gotten out of control um, so that was just one of the things I've been thinking about and I'll start thinking about a plan I really enjoyed her video and it was seen, really motivated me to want to change and do better um, so I'm thinking about like gym memberships and things like that and I'm thinking about joining the YMCA because I know with the Y um, with the baby and everything they could watch him while I work out and me and my husband that's something we can do together so I'm thinking about joining the YMCA so I'll look into that but I really noticed that my weight has gotten out of control and it's just not good so that's what that's my start of Thursday morning <laughs> thinking about my weight and my health is not good diabetes running my family high cholesterol heart issues running my family is really bad and I'm letting it get out of control and I can't do that I gotta be a better example for baby boy as well especially as he starts to eat solids he, and I gotta make sure I'm being a good example for him so any tips you guys have what has worked for you but I know my main issue is fast food and I'm not drinking um, as much water as I should be drinking um, and so I, I gotta do better I gotta do better so that'll be my goal this week and maybe start talking about some of the things I'm gonna do what I'm gonna change and actually putting it into action you know I just picked up Emmanuel I figured I'll go to the um, the grocery store to get some fruits and vegetables maybe to make a big thing a smoothie um, and I can use that for my lunch um, I don't know what exactly to get but the closest grocery store is Walmart I don't like really going grocery shopping at Walmart but that's the closest thing I can think of um, at least so I can get something healthy for tomorrow um, for lunch and for dinner tonight I figure I'll cook some fish um, I wish I would have took it out earlier I forgot but I gotta do better y'all I really gotta do better I'm gonna try I don't know <laughs> hey, I forgot to vlog at um, Walmart I totally forgot but I'll show you guys a few things that I got from Walmart um, also my mother-in-law she's gonna be a big help as I try to learn to eat better and live a better lifestyle um, cuz she's really good she's really into smoothies and eating better and exercising so she kind of showed me a few things to get but um, I'll show you guys my Walmart haul <laughs> I just got a few things I didn't get a lot you can probably hear baby boy in the background. All right, I got the um, blueberry slim life green tea. Um, 
to help. Um, I saw that on Miss V Holmes' blog. My mother-in-law said get some Activity, Activia, and that helps too um, because it has a lot of good vitamins and everything in it. Um, she worked with a personal trainer for a while, and he recommended these protein bars. And usually you eat half of it at a time along with your smoothie. Um, and so I will probably do this for lunch, half of this bar and my smoothie shakes for lunchtime. Um, and so I got these from Walmart. I think they were like a dollar and 18 cent a pack. But she said her personal trainer recommended these the most. Um, I also got these greens. This will go in the smoothie. Um, the main thing is baby spinach and kale. She recommended that. Um, and she loves Honeycrisp apples. So she told me to get some of these to add to this. And I also have a um, bag of um, frozen mixed fruit too. I'll add to this to make my smoothies. Um, I just got some water jug. This was like 88 cent. And so I just got this to put the smoothies in for my lunches. Um, and I got this jug of water. Um, I have bottled waters, but I figured this would be better. And I can just fill it up every day on my way home, on my way to work. And this is 2.2 liters. So I guess this is the recommended amount you should drink each day. Um, and I also just got a plain pitcher um, just to put my smoothies in too um, during the day. So that's just a few things I got to help me get started. My, again, my main weakness is lunch. Um, and so that's what I got. Also, I went to, um, I live in Williams, I'm at, I work in Williamsburg by an outlet mall, and I got Emmanuel some stride rights. Um, everybody kept saying that he needs them, but um, this got good support. And this is a four, four and a half. And these are cute, they were on sale for $20, 19 dollars And so they'll help with his posture, she said, and help him to have more confidence in his walking. Y'all can probably hear him back here making all this noise. Say hi. That I'm making a lot of noise. <laughs> that I, he is really moving fast. That I'm making a lot of noise. Say yes. Say hi. Hello. Now he wants to be quiet. <laughs> but yeah, I got these stripe right shoes. I'm excited to put them on. Shoes are so darn hard to put on his feet. I don't know why. He wiggles so doggone much. But, um... I hope they work out right. I think I forgot to tell y'all. Um, I've been entering Emmanuel on Instagram. It's different companies. It's called a brand rep model. So basically, you enter um your baby and or any child into contests on Instagram brands host searches. And so if they you they'll have different rules and stuff set aside. And if they like your pictures, they basically choose you to represent their company. And basically send you free things um, to try out and you have to kind of take a picture of your um, child and the item and you kind of promote their company so Emmanuel was chosen for a company called Skyland Clips and if y'all follow me on Instagram you can see it um, so we just got chosen and I'm super excited so he'll be kind of like a baby model <laughs> but it's gonna be exciting it's a t-shirt company and um, so she says she'll send me the items next week. So hopefully by the end of next week, you should see some pictures coming out. I'm kind of nervous. I don't know what to expect. I hope she liked the pictures. And I hope I meet, you know, her expectations. But I'm excited. He'll be a brand rep, basically. Instagram famous <laughs> baby on Instagram. <laughs> but I'm excited, though. It's really cool. So I'll try, I, at first, I was just going to give up because I didn't think people would want to pick him. Because my pictures weren't all that, you know. Some people have, like, professional pictures with their kids. But um, I was surprised we got chosen. So I'm excited. And I'll keep entering him into stuff like that. Because that would be cool to get his face out there, you know. So I'm excited. And I'm happy for him. <laughs> right now, I'm steaming some vegetables. Um, these are, like, organic. It's a bag of organic mixed vegetables. And I'm making some salmon in the oven. Um, and a potato for my husband. I figure I'll put some of these vegetables in a, uh, the baby bullet for the baby too. All right, y'all. This is the salmon. It looks good, don't it? And I basically um, just put it on some aluminum foil pan. I put a little bit of oil, um, olive oil at the bottom, um, just some um, parsley, and a little bit of old bay seasoning for the yeah. salmon. Just a little bit of mixed vegetables. Again, this was just like a, um, a organic batch of mixed vegetables that I got from Kroger.